Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure. Welcome back to Going Medieval, uh, where I'd love to say that something dramatic was about to happen, but it isn't. Uh, everything's fine. Uh, to the extent that I'm starting to go, ah, oh, maybe we'll just, we'll take the next dangerous opportunity that comes our way and see how we get on with it. Um, construction's continuing. Yeah, we've got a bit missing there, which is rather perplexing, but I'm sure it'll be, I'm sure it'll be picked up in the fullness of time. Uh, well, I should probably harvest these mushrooms. I know, this is the kind of high-octane thrill ride that we're on at the moment, is uh, just going, oh, yeah, there's some mushrooms, oh, that's lovely. Um, yeah, no, it's all, it, it's all good. We've got, uh, we've got construction going on all over the place. I am slightly, slightly concerned uh, about, uh, about defences, particularly putting up these steps. Now, why was I bothered about that? I was, I was definitely, I was definitely bothered about oh yeah i was bothered about it in case the bandits do have some kind of wall climbing technology in which case i've given them easy egress points to get to the uh, the core of the settlement rather than the plan which is uh, to you know try and funnel them in through the front gate which eventually i'll pack out with traps and we'll we'll make sure we've got good archer coverage and and it'll all be brilliant yeah Anyway, that's what we're working towards, uh, and uh, I invite you to... Now, it's day 10 of spring, uh, and therefore, ooh, you know, anything could happen. Um, uh, yeah, it, uh, we could have a uh, an arrival at any point. Um, someone said that, uh, that getting Dan to do a bit of smelting, as well as this hammer work that he's currently working on, uh, might up his tempo with regards to his blacksmithing skill a little bit quicker. As soon as he gets to level twenty, then we're then we're flying. Then we've got uh, we've got crossbows, we've got traps, we've got all kinds of stuff that we can start working on. Uh, but until that point, not so much. No, no, not so much. So uh, so we're working down as hard as can be. If we if we call him up here uh, now that he's actually doing his job, of course, uh, Dan. Hello, Dan. Uh, you are, well, I'll wait for it here. Right, smithing. He's got a thousand of 3,000 experience uh, that he requires to uh, to level up further. The bad news is he hasn't got any stars next to it, so he doesn't learn particularly quickly. He's still only got a thousand. Maybe he needs to complete something to, uh, uh, to get the goods. Uh, now, the reason that I'm not smelting more of the iron ingots that we have going on is that I've got 216 ingots already which is probably more than i need um but i i imagine raw iron doesn't actually do you any good so maybe if we maybe if we slap that on i reckon he could turn them around quicker you know or is making weaponry going to be the more efficient thing for him to do i know it's a it's an interesting question it's a a, a real puzzler it's a perplexer is what it is um but I'm, gonna, I'm just going to let him figure it out for himself. Uh, it's only a matter of waiting, so, it's, you know, eventually we'll get there. Now then, down here somewhere, uh, there, I would argue, Cedric's working on the fridge. That's, that's dramatic. Let's go down there and say hello. Hello, on. Here we go. Cedric. There you go. Da Cedric, fridge working on the... No idea if this is going to be dark enough, deep enough, or anything like that. It's under the roof. Is that, is that a good thing? I don't know. Um, it should be deep enough. Should be. But we just, we don't know. Um, no, we don't. Uh, now, it might need might also need walls. We don't know. Um, uh, in order to, to qualify for refrigeration purposes. It might need to be deeper. We don't know. Uh, the, none of these things are, 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 have been communicated to me by the game in a way that I found compelling and or able to retain. So uh, so we're going to have to wait and see. Uh, the, the only reason I, I, I might consider banging in some walls would be to put up some uh, some ceiling supports to stop the whole thing falling down, which is probably a smart idea. Also, if we get these steps built, then Cedric hasn't got to go the long way. Yeah. So we probably ought to get that done also. If we knock out these two bits of wall, stick in a little bit of, uh, I don't know, clay, stone, whatever, um, then we could put a door in here, which will allow us to keep the cold in, theoretically. Yeah, all right, let's uh, let's book that. I mean, it's 
you, I mean, they're potentially load-bearing bits, but we'll see how we get on with that. Uh, I do have some research available. Maybe that will be something that's that's riveting and exciting. Let's uh, let's let's see what we've got. Uh, Fifty of each, solid. Uh, defensive structures. What does this get me? Uh, that's decorative structures. Yeah, danglers. Um, uh, metal traps. Uh, yeah, well, that's great. But I, I need the. Uh, I'm going to need mechanical ding dongs before that's any good to me at all. Uh, armorer, armorer. Yeah, what can we make with that? Mail armor. Oh, that might be fun. Yeah, it might be. Yeah. No, oh, it might. It might well be. But apparently, this only defends against blades, which is. It's not all that. And then the furniture, of course. Uh, for those of you who really like a table. Yeah, it's just not that. It's just not that riveting. I don't know where excitement is going to reside. Uh, distilling requires 15 of the next kind of research. Well, I could get that on the go, I suppose. But it doesn't feel like it actually is going to push us forward, particularly. Crossbows too. We aren't even making crossbows yet. Why don't you ease back a bit and make some of the stuff you can actually make? Yes. All right, then. Let's go decorative structures. Because uh, apparently there is a buff that they convey uh, to uh, to any working environment they're in. So I could give Dan a whole bunch of danglers. I mean, I've got some already. Look, there are some danglers going on there. Uh, hold on, it would be helpful if I could highlight the actual thing I was talking about. There you go. One banner wall medium. Yeah. Uh, is connected to... Thank you, autosave. Uh, is connected to a stable structure. It's... There it is. See? Description. It's a jaunty pennant fluttering in the breeze. Great. Uh, no mention of a buff being present, but yay, we'll 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 take whatever uh, whatever it does, and uh, we'll enjoy that. Now it could also be, of course, that oh, hold on, what do we want here? What do you need? You need an iron ingot, yeah, and uh, it's a beautiful heraldic shield that brightens up a plain wall. Fab. A uh, wall bookshelf. Okay. Well, hold on. Well, let's. I'm going to slap a, a, a bookshelf or two in here. I might even go for I might even go for, for two. There you go. I have two two bookshelves. Given that that's the books department, we'll see how that goes. Uh, then what else have we got going on here? This is a uh, oak brethren wall decoration. Oh, lovely. Uh, the church of restitution wall decoration. Oh, brilliant. The uh, wall pottery shelf. Oh, fabulous. And you know what? I'm going to stick I'm going to stick a couple of those in the kitchen. Yeah, why not? I and mean, you know, where else would you put it? Dining room. Dining room. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's let's do it. Yeah, it doesn't seem to want to play ball. It might do if I get to the right level. There you go. Slap some of those on there. I went with three. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm really pushing it out there. Uh, a wall deer head decoration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's let's do some of that too. The reason for sticking them in here, people come down here to eat. You see, and therefore they're going to see it and go, oh, look at how how brilliant we've become over time gradually without uh, without chancing anything too risky and uh, and falling afoul of of potential woes and difficulty yeah that, that's what they're saying i can i can tell what's this one a wall tool shelf okay let us just give it some yeah dan you're in business mate now have i got anywhere i can dangle this i could put it on the outside i don't think putting it on the outside is going to be any good to us Put it on the inside there. That's got a beam in there. Yeah, I thought that was probably going to uh, probably going to be argumentative. Maybe make Dan a brand new workshop. What's wrong with the existing one? Nothing. It's just taking Dan a very long time to use it. How's his skill looking? Sixteen hundred. He's going to be at this a while. Oh come on, Dan! I want to progress. You know, is that so much to ask? Mind you, he could potentially. What if we uh, what if we were to cancel that well we'd take that down to two so when he's finished this one he's done you can keep his smelting weapon order going on there and uh that'll be that'll be solid but i don't know anyway dan's going to be out that for a bit we got mining going on nobody can be bothered to pick the mushrooms well as long as they don't gripe about us not having enough food uh yeah okay no they probably don't no they're probably probably fine with the old food idea there uh Who's working on stuff that shouldn't be working on stuff? You know what? I think we'll tag the professor into doing a bit of uh, a bit of research. 
I'm I'm fine with the amount of research we've got going on for the moment. Let's uh, let's up the tempo. Right, so you can go as a two, yeah. And cut plants is also a two, so you should immediately spring into action. Well, she's she sprung somewhere certainly. Yeah. What are you, what are you doing up there? I'm doing a bit of construction. Are you? What are you constructing? What are you constructing? Oh no, you're tailoring. No, oh, okay, cool. Well, you know what? We need we need cloth and clothing and all of that. This is a terrible place to put my uh, uh, my tailoring station. Terrible place. Miles away from anywhere useful. The resources are all nowhere to be seen. I should I should probably tear the whole thing down and rebuild it. But it seems like an awful lot of work, especially when uh, Faye, who is our uh, our construction uh, magistrate, is uh, is still magistrating. All over the place, but he's putting up more wooden floor. But he's just going to go. I don't know why I'm doing this. Kind of goes defensive, Faye. It's going to keep us, you know. It's going to keep us safe from harm. You sure it's not just going to wall us in with the bad guys? Well, only if the bad guys turn. I've, I've up the tempo right up. You know, there's enough enough going on here. Right, let's talk region here. Uh, we currently have sixty percent region influence. That's nice. I I imagine later on in the game's development that these will mean something at the moment we just know they exist uh right now they don't do it. this is it this is what you get from the screen and you're going oh yeah oh, mm. ah yes that's clearly important and then you leave again yeah there it is come on bank get your hammer going he's he's hungry he's bored he's miserable he's Two thirds of the way there. Come on, Dan. I believe in you. Ah, look. You see, look. He's he got a bit of smithing going, or was it somebody else? Ah, I wasn't watching. Anyway, he almost finished that. Come on, Dan. Stop praying. Get back to this. The whatever deity is your uh, your uh, administrating uh, is unlikely to finish this job. That's your job, Dan. Oh, he's gone to sleep. But that's the end of another perfect day in the neighbourhood. Yes. Good leather summer clothing. Okay. Sturdy linen summer clothing. That's nice. I'll tell you what, I'll put a tall whatnot up in here as well. Uh, decorations. Wall shelf thing. Tall whatnot. Pottery? No. Church of Red? No. Oak bread? No. Tall shelf. There you are. Slap that in there. Whether or not it, it comes up with the results anybody's guess but uh we'll, we'll stick it in there anyway i've got a lot of stuff that's the other thing that's that's absent uh, that i imagine will come further in development is trade uh i've got a whole bunch of stuff that i've made and uh it would be nice to be able to flog some of it uh and maybe buy i i don't know uh the, some pharmaceuticals or similar uh, yeah, but uh, it, we are where we are for the moment you know what you could do i could go down a the kitchen there you go no, yeah, I see. Thinking, go down the kitchen and uh, and tell the kitchen to get to work on uh, on making some medical kits. Do they do that here? Hold on. Um, no. Okay. Well, let's. Uh, well, we've got a mission. We've got a mission going on, and that is find out where you make medical kits. Right. Okay. Well, it's not there. Is it the campfire? What? Well, don't be daft. It's not here either. No. Okay. All right. Well, where? All right. Well, you've... Tailors is possible. Let's have a look. Tailoring. Uh, recyc. Yeah. Recyc. Yeah. Shield. Really? Okay. A leather hat. Oh, yeah. Let... No, we need some of those. Oh, I need... I need 10 of these, please. Yeah. No. Give me... Give me 10 of those. Uh, that we're making so many gambasons. Is possibly uh, unnecessary, but we're making them, and therefore, you know, we'll embrace them as they're delivered. Uh, okay, medical kits. If I was a medical kit, where would I be made? Let's have a quick look at what we've got here. Butchering? No, really isn't. Uh, campfire armourers? Doubtful. Uh, bowyers? No. Research? Unlikely. Research? No. Woodworking bench? No, no, no. I don't feel like any of those. Sewing station, I think, is possibly the best bet, but I, I think I just poked that. No, that's the armourer's station. The sewing station's down on the ground floor. Okay, all right, let's uh, let's go check. It's here, look. Oh, no, it's a little... 
We got uh, jumper, yeah. Summer clothes, right. Uh, cap, yeah. Straw hat. Well, it's not one of them. Okay. Where, where else would you make a first aid kit? Like a chemistry station or something like that? I thought it had chemistry. I think, you oh no, you haven't. You haven't got chemistry. What do I need for chemistry? Oh, you've got to get some tier three bad boys on the go. Oh, there we go. There's your, there's your medical kits. Right. Well, we know what we're chasing then. We're going to go for teeth. Hang on. Got it. Right. Okay. Hello. Here we go. Here's a troublemaker. Ah, oh, there's no troublemaker. It's Oz. Oz has come back to us. Hello, Oz Woz. Uh, welcome to, uh, to the old Borax there. What are you good at? He's an intellectual. Uh, all right. He's got a bit of tailoring um, and a bit of Bonnie. Okay. Welcome, Ozzy Oz the Second. Go and get yourself uh, patched up, you old, you old Oz, you. Right, let's put you on a convalesce one. Let's put you on a, a tend to others two. No, well, no, I'll leave that on a one as well. Hunt can stay three. I'm going to put you on a haul two. You can you can do that for the time being until I can think of something better to do with you. I could have him on research, but I'll be honest, the professor's doing a fine, 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 fine job there. So uh, I don't see any real need to do so. What I do see the need to do is turn this emergency... Well, I'm lost. Hang on. it's around, I left it here somewhere. I haven't got that many buildings. There we go. It's over here. This is a bit of a catch-all building at the moment. We've got some rubbish sitting there. That's rotten meat. Well, that's a waste. Stew's rotting on the stockpile. Again. Uh, and the bow table's the wrong way around. Yeah. Then you've got the research going on in here. And then you've got Joker's uh, sleeping in here too. Yeah, I really, really ought to think this round. Yeah. Oh, hello. Summertime. All your food will rot. Great. That's exactly what I was looking forward to. Thanks for that. No, cheers. No, brilliant. No, cheers. No, brilliant. Yeah. Faye, do you fancy building something rather than a uh, uh, a bit of wall? Actually, you're almost done. I'm going to let you finish it, and then you can take the satisfaction in a job well done. Um, yeah, that, that feels like a sound plan. So I think what we need to do is build a new research hut. Yes. And, uh, and possibly rethink our uh, our overall workshopping solutions to become slightly more uh, slightly more effective. Now we've got our our core storage here, but I think I ought to start breaking it up and bringing some of it inside and and moving it around generally. Let's uh, let's get down and put these walls in because I imagine we're yeah there we are. All right, Cedric, you've done a bang up job there, son. Uh, well done, loving it. Yeah. You've done the research thing, but you haven't actually commissioned it yet. Give it time. Oh, hello. What's this? Oh, bit of inclement weather. I mean, they've painted a very dramatic picture of what that might entail. Uh, but I think they're just uh, they're doing that just to make you feel edgy. Uh, reinforced door? I don't think we need a reinforced door. I think a basic door will do us absolutely fine there. Uh, Cedric there. He's knocking it out. That was loud. Okay. Oh, it's Faye. He's back from the upside. And he's he's gone. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll come and work down here for a bit. It's scary up there. And I don't want to get struck by lightning. If it's all the same to you. The professor's now got 18 in uh, in tailoring. That's nice. Seriously. She's been at it for like two minutes. And has picked up another level of skill. Meanwhile, flipping Dan. Thunstorm's over. All right. We'll go up and see if the entire place is burnt to the ground in a moment. You need, you're going to need to put walls in for that to work, son. Yeah. Have we dug everything out? We've dug out enough to uh, to get us started. All right, well, let's dig out enough to put in a little bit of extra support. Up one, please. Thank you. All right, so if we go here. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and select the whatnot then. All right, do a bit of that. And then do a bit of this. We'll put walls in there, and we'll run joists across those, and uh, and that will that will provide a little bit of ceiling support should it be required. We don't know if it's required or not. Eventually, I can dig out all these walls, of course, but I feel no uh, no compulsion to do that immediately. Right, let's uh, let's go and have a look and see what we want. All right, all right, a terrifying thunderstorm with fires and lightning and all of that business. 
you say so. Uh, there we are. Yeah, no, it's, no, no it's, that's not a thing that's, that's bothered us in the slightest. But it's all good. It's all, it's all fine. Yeah, right. We probably ought to uh, uh, stick Felony Lad, new arrival boy, on, uh, on some sort of schedule. Right, well, we'll have you sleep a bit here. Yeah, and not there. Okay. Leisure. We're going to pre-book you for some leisure so that you stay happy. Worky, work, work, yeah. And then uh, worky, work, 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 yeah. And then uh, work, work. Yeah, and you're, you're free to amuse yourselves the rest of the time. Why are you giving them free time in the middle of the day? Why don't you take these two as work? Yeah. Faye's about to give me a look to say, what are you doing? Uh, and then we take two out. No, let's take three. No, yeah. No, two. Let's take three out. Slap a bit more work in there, and that way he's got some slightly more effective time usage. He's not going to burn his time going back and forth uh, from uh, from work sites to home. I'm not sure that this is necessarily going to work out well, but Faye's been with us a long time. He's he's well aware that we have an experimental nature uh, in the things that we do. You could put a bit of mandatory leisure in that middle block. I could, couldn't I? You know what I'm not going to do, though? Is it that? I'm not going to do that. Uh, right. Well, also, Dan, you Roddy legend. Dan's there. We're there. Dan is there. Well, we're all there. But with Dan, and he's there. Uh, but uh, I'm just going to uh, I'm just going to institute the similar, uh, a similar proposition. Yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, work Cedric until he dies. Well, that's not a, that's not a nice thing to do. Two, three of those. Yeah. Right. Everyone else seems to be absolutely fine. Right, Daniel. Uh, we're on a new mission, man. Right. Uh, let's first off. Let's uh, let's let's kill this construction menu, and then that smell ingots until you have. Uh, let's go for. All right. Yeah. 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 No, no. Add another hundred. There you go. Three hundred and seventy ingots is more than enough for any ingot desiring individual. Um, right. Uh, I want uh, mechanical components. In fact, you can uh, you forget making swords. We're not interested. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, until you have one. Yes. Okay. Smelt items. Ah, no. Smelt items forever. But only if their quality is lower than superior. Right. And their hit points are... 70. Now, I don't know if that means that we're only going to do flimsy to superior if they're under 100 hit points. If we will keep flimsy weapons with higher amounts of hit points, it doesn't make any sense. But uh, we're going to burn anything under 90 hit point, 90 percent hit points. That seems extreme. Uh, and uh, and anything that is under superior. That's that's the right way to think about it. Okay. Well, let's. Yeah, no, we'll we'll do that. Yeah, I don't know if it's an and or an if. You see, that's the if if or yeah, you know, all of those uh, all of those ideas. Right, mechanical components though is the thing that we care about more than absolutely anything else, and uh, we will do until we have. Uh, let's get carried away. Three hundred in stock. There you go, Dan. That's going to keep you busy for absolutely. That's a lot of it. That's a lot of components. That's more components than you're ever going to use. All right, hang on, I'm taking it back. You're going to use up all your iron on stuff you don't need very many of. All right, keep going till we've got 50 in stock. That's better. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Good. Dan, you have earned my praise. There you go. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, that's that's as much praise as you need. Um, you guys you didn't actually give me any praise. I said I was going to. Raw meat's rotted on the stockpile. Oh, I've got to get this... Flipping kitchen done. Uh, right. Oh, meanwhile, we have got the ability to uh, to wall it a little. I don't know if this is going to work, but I should probably assign a little bit of, uh, of food storage here ASAP. Yeah, we ought to uh, expedite. Hey, start expediting. Right, I'm uh, do you want to put some floor in here? I think it would probably be helpful. All right, hang on. Let's go back to the right menu. Do this. We'll have we'll, nothing but the priciest floor, please. Limestone flipping block. Let's roll. Yeah. 
stick it on in there because that's cool. A lime limestone block on the floor. That and I'll keep your feet cool. Uh, that's under floor cooling. That is when it's not even under the floor. It is the floor. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're clearing out. Good. Yeah. If you want to do some construction, lads, this works for me. Uh, right, construction yard. What? Settlers are idle. That feels unlikely. Settlers' wounds need tending. That feels more more plausible. Nobody should be idle. Who's idle? Dan. Dan! Get back to work, Dan! You can't possibly be idle. You've got jobs to do. Dan! I just put in a big instruction of stuff you should be doing. A big one. A big instruction. Like a proper... Proper... I put this in until we got 50 of those. Oh, hello. What's going on? Minus assassin. Oh, this is what we were waiting for. What are we looking at? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Potentially up to five archers and then five regular banditos as well. Okay, then. Right. Well, here we go, team. Let's uh, let's get to the ready room. Yeah, all right. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, Oswald, just saying that this dagger that you're currently sporting that's not going to work for you uh, i possibly should have given you an instruction on this front a little earlier on but that's that very much on me there you go don't you don't need a shield yeah uh, you can have whatever hat takes your fancy you can have whatever armor takes your fancy good right and then uh get yourself over here where there should be a bow or a crossbow or flipping something lying around uh, there's a sword Dan made that. It's a flimsy iron short sword. The quality does not surprise me. Yeah. Dan, small detail. Doesn't look like we've got any more bows. The only oh, oh what's that? That's a spear. That's not the same thing. No, it really isn't. Uh, what's that? It's a cudgel. Yeah. Go to the bow shop. Yeah. Bow shop's empty, gov. Ah. Uh, Okay, what's my bow limit? Five long bows, five short bows. We should have. Okay, well, we apparently we've got five of each. All right, you say that, but where are they? And uh, maybe Dan, maybe Oz will figure it out for himself. Former Oz died, and uh, and as it stands, new Oz is likely to go the same way. Yeah, where else could I be storing it? I've got other store yard area bits somewhere. We are paused. Oh, 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 hey, oh, hey, oh, I was looking straight at it. Uh, right, low armour and shield rating, yes, or low armour and shield rating. Right, Oz, Oz, get yourself for one of these. Uh, equip it. He, he, I'm too stupid. All right, get yourself a rubbish one. There you are. Okay, and then once you've done that, come up the, uh, come up the shed. Uh, right, to the shed, everybody. Uh, Faye, yeah, you are uh, drafted, and you are going to hang out here. You're going, why don't you stick them on the wall? Uh, no. Really? We're going straight for the redoubt? Yeah, yeah, the wall's not ready yet. All right, okay. All right, uh, Rosie, get up here. Uh, Jolly, get up here. I don't give him the, uh, the action words. There we are. Right, I'm going to finish prepping. And we will see the final battle in the final episode tomorrow. I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very much for watching. It's going to be a rip snorter of excitement. And you would be well to watch it. Or not, as the case may be. Thanks very much for watching. I've been Colonel Failure. Cheerio. Well, there you go. The stage is set for what is sure to be an absolute slam dunk of a final episode to wrap up the series. The defences are in place such as they are everyone's got a bow i've got plenty of everyone's in order to fight off the incoming scourge are you on the edge of your seat i thought you might be and uh, and therefore it's it's all to look forward to and i i anticipate seeing you there to see exactly what happens